even though I'm a grown boy, this video is going out to that inner girl who is obsessed with trying to be cool, trading Pokemon cards instead of STDs, <laughs> and caring way too much about what other people think. <clears throat> Dear me. You suck. You suck because you never stopped thinking about what other people are thinking about you. You suck because you never ignored the haters. You took every single word to heart. You suck because you allowed yourself to be bullied and be a target for bullies. However, it's not your fault. It sucks that you got bullied and you're probably being bullied right now. But you know what? It's worth it. It's awesome that you got bullied and you know why? Because it's going to make you stronger. Well, maybe not physically, but mentally. <laughs> all the hate you'll receive will actually help you build a shield that will allow you to turn all the negative things into positive things. So you know what? Don't worry about the bullies. Just crank up that new Kelly Clarkson song and sing out loud, What doesn't kill you makes you stronger! And it'll be great material for your Snapchats on Music Monday. Honestly, don't give up hope. But you know what you should give up? Sucking ass. Or what the 90s kids used to call it, sucking up to someone. <laughs> That person you're trying to suck up to for their approval to be accepted as one of the cool kids. Well, I'm sorry to say it, but it's never gonna happen. And you know why? Because you are that chubby, freckle face, four eyes, ginger freak who makes YouTube videos on the internet. So stop looking for approval from others. It's not worth your time. Instead, use that time to focus on yourself. So stop trying to make being cool a thing because it is just not gonna happen. And you're gonna be happy that you didn't fall into that cool clique because you're gonna end up finding who your real friends are. You're gonna leave your high school, become an adult, and move on to do some amazing things. While those so-called cool kids who talked about you behind your back well, they'll stay exactly where they are, carrying on this fabricated cool kid label and still stuck in the good old high school days. Whether you are 12 or 17 watching this, I know that you are so confused right now about life, yourself, your everything. <laughs> and all I can say is that you're gonna figure out almost everything out over time. And things get better. I know everyone says that, but honestly, girl, <laughs> Things get better. So much better than you could ever imagine right now. Here's something you'll regret later though. You were gonna turn down the opportunity of becoming an actor just because you thought you were too chubby, too ugly, and just too not fabulous, and not good enough to be a comedic individual in front of a camera. <laughs> Well, you know what? That is just downright ridiculous, and you should never turn down an opportunity as amazing as that. Like, ever. In fact, if you had gone on to become an actor, you could have been a background actor in this new upcoming film called Mean Girls. You could have been the one sitting in front of Lindsay Lohan when Santa Claus comes in and yells out your name, saying, Four for you, Glen Coco! You go, Glen Coco! But instead, you will decide not to do acting. And all I'm gonna say is that you could have been Glen Coco. But you know what? That's okay, because you'll still end up on the internet making people laugh and smile, so... You get the best of both worlds. Well, not really, because you could have been Glen Coco! <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna tell you something that you're always told, but you always just brush it off your shoulders. And that is to treat others with respect just as you would want to be respected. Your friends will always be there for you, to support you, to talk to you, and to develop an emotional bond with. However, most of your friendships are gonna come to an end. And those moments with your friends well, they'll last forever, so don't be sad about it. Move on and make some new friends. Maybe try out this new thing called YouTube? People change and you will change. Don't be afraid of that. Be who you want to be and don't change who you are because someone tells you otherwise. You're gonna change the world one day, one smile at a time, and it's gonna make everything awful going on right now worth it in the end. So never lose hope and don't give up on your dreams, as cheesy as that sounds. Oh, and don't give up your fucking Pokemon cards, you idiot. Love yourself. So in the comments below or in a hashtag dear me video, let me know what would you say to yourself a year ago or maybe even 10 years ago? And to put a spit on things, what would you want your future self to tell you now? Also make sure you give it a big thumbs up as it supports me because it really helps a bitch out, so help a bitch out. All my social media links will be down below, but you don't have to follow me. That's okay, whatevs. But yeah, that's it for this week's video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.